Should I trust the name of this knit story? First, let me remove this one, which sometimes it happens unless you close the program. My loving Hadron Collider. Please. <laughs> this private message is intended for our faithful participant, subject name. If you are not subject name, please place your fingers in your ears and hum loudly for the duration of this message. Congratulations, subject name, on your selection for participation in this experiment, which is being performed for the good of all mankind. You've been randomly selected from the global population of 9 billion individuals to participate in this experiment. Please be informed that participation in this experiment is entirely optional. If you do not wish to participate in this beneficial experiment, you will be offered opportunity to fill out the necessary forms of exclusion at the conclusion of this experiment. Please be informed that this experiment is entirely tended for the benefit of mankind. By participating in this experiment, you are fulfilling your solemn duty as a citizen of this planet to aid all other living organisms. And please be informed that for the duration of this experiment, your status as a living organism is rescinded. Please be informed that while all possible health and safety protocols are being observed, we cannot account for all possible events that may occur during the course of this experiment, and we are not liable for any injury, trauma, or death that may occur should your death occur. We are required to deliver your body or next of kin within 3 to 15 working years. Finally, be aware that you may find this experiment physically demanding, but is also intended to be both enjoyable and rewarding for all participants. The experiment will begin in five seconds. Good luck, subject name. Test 1. Enter the loop and collect the patented energy orb. Please note, the walls of the loop contain valuable machi machinery not to be touched. Test failed. Okay. So we gotta collect it. The patented energy orb is licensed by the Coca-Cola Corporation, all rights reserved. Test 2. Use light signs to avoid obstacles in the loop and collect the patented force reactor. Okay. Oops. Well, we know what a failure is. Oh, for crying out loud. At least we can tell where they're gonna be. Dot, 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 dot. C -c congratulations subject name, you've s passed test 3, unexpected exposure to death beam. Please remember that while tests may appear hazardous, you are in fact totally safe. Please note, the next test involves exposure to highly dangerous super particles. Side effects with contact with super particles include death. The force reactor, copyright Pringles Corporation, is designed to react with light force particles. Test 4. Use the patented force reactor to navigate the loop. Okay. Just barely. Sometimes you want to slow down, though. Nice concept. Orange particles have proved highly dangerous in previous tests. Do not approach. The particle you have just integrated is highly dangerous. It will be confiscated at the end of testing. Congratulations on your progress. The final test, Test 5, will begin after this brief presentation. Note the three super particles are now present. Red particles, as you know, are totally safe. Yellow particles are dangerous to touch, but do not be afraid to approach them. Green particles are highly volatile and must be completely avoided at all times. All super particles are patented and kindly donated by the Apple Corporation. Test 5. Recognition and avoidance of super particles in the loop. After this test, you will be released.
Yeah, right. You call those safe. I see. You put the shock enemies behind the yellow ones. Oh, what? Please remember the green particle is highly dangerous. Do not attempt to approach it. Sparkle will kill you. Keep away from it. This is your final warning. Turn back. Uh, in another language. But it's the only way, I think. Loud too. That's that's my main beef with those. I think it's the only way, though. <laughs> your patented force reactor is now redundant and has been removed. Congratulations on your com completing your test. Your duty is complete. Your country served. Due to foreseen faults, your release has been slightly delayed. We are slightly... We are sorry for the inconvenience. A technician will come to free you shortly. In the meantime, please enjoy the slight music. Thank you for your patience. Your release is imminent. In 30 seconds, you will be disintegrated and your particles will be flushed from the loop. Thank you for serving your nation through your participation in this testing exercise. I see there's no ex no barrier- no- You were ordered not to touch the machinery. <laughs> I'm turning the volume down a bit. And back up. Now it's gonna be crazy. Congratulations, creator of this knit story, for startling the cat. Well, at least it's not hard anymore. Communications are rest loop is breached. Can't get too close. Participant is still alive. Alert. Seal the breach quickly. And it goes back down now. <laughs> and back up. If I know how to adjust the volume in the dark. Yes, Zumi, I play it with the lights off. Subject name. Please be aware that the green particle you absorbed is highly dangerous. 
For the good of all people, you must be placed under quarantine. Please drop the energy orb, force reactor, and the orange, the blue and orange particles. Once this is done, you'll be escorted to quarantine room four. Please comply immediately. What am I supposed to do now? Oh. So I still have them, thankfully. Okay, now it seems to be infinite. Now for the credits. Tile sets. <laughs> And the ambience from partnersinrhyme.com. Thank you for serving our, your nation and participating in this mandatory test. I thought it was optional. My name is Cave Stroy, and I have a trumpet and I am blowing it. My name is Rhetoric Sue, and I wish I had a trumpet. Talk about drafting. <laughs> 